Hey, I'm David Casey, a solutions engineer at Snap. Today we're going to go over how to improve your event quality score to help get better results for your business. Before we get started, let's cover a few prerequisites. This tutorial assumes that you've created a Snapchat ad account and that you've created a Snap Pixel and installed it on your website. If you still need to set up an ad account or Pixel, please follow the instructions in our Business Help Center and then come back to this video. Event Quality Score, commonly abbreviated to EQS, indicates how effective the customer parameters and identity signals passed with your app and web conversion events may be at matching to a Snapchat account. Matched events help you deliver your ads to Snapchatters who are more likely to take action you care about and attribute those actions back to your ads. We calculate a score out of 10 based on the quality of the data we receive for a specific event and integration source. There are three main components to your score. What user parameters are being received, the quality of the parameters sent, and the percent of events receiving those parameters. To view our EQS score, we will go to Snapchat Ads Manager, and then in the upper left, we'll click the drop-down and select Events Manager. Next, we'll click our event source. And if we scroll down, we can see each event that we're passing and the associated event quality score. If you see an NA for the event quality score, like we see for this purchase event, then you may not be passing the event. If you verified that you're passing the event and it's been more than 24 hours since you started passing it, then there may be an issue. Contact your account representative or raise a ticket with Snapchat to get help. A good EQS is at least six, which indicates that the data being sent is effective at matching to a Snapchat account. Improving your EQS can also improve the results you see from your ads. Web advertisers who grew their event quality score from a 3 to a 5 saw a median 26% higher return on ad spend in a recent SNAP study. Stay tuned if your score is lower than a 6, as we'll be going over tips you can use to raise your EQS later in this video. The simplest way to improve your EQS score is to ensure that you are passing parameters that are most likely to match to a Snapchatter. Hashed email, hash phone number, and click ID are some of the highest priority parameters. Refer to the depicted order of priorities and determine what parameters you should prioritize. Remember, every additional parameter increases the chance that your events will match to a Snapchatter. As previously mentioned, the next two components of EQS calculation are the quality of the parameters being sent and the percent of events receiving those parameters and warnings are provided in the Diagnostics section of Events Manager. Click into one of your event sources and then click the Diagnostics tab in the left hand side. As you can see, an implementation error has been surfaced for my pixel. You can also see errors, warnings, and other issues by clicking into an event source and looking at the card for each event type. If an error or warning is present, it will be shown as a badge on the right side of the card. You can view the details of these errors or warnings by expanding the event and looking at the issues section of the event card. You may see additional high priority issues related to specific parameters highlighted as badges below the issues section. And you can also click into view event quality score and hover over the information icon beside each parameter to view issues specific to that parameter. Remember, you'll get the most impact out of prioritizing resolving issues for high priority parameters such as email and phone number. If you see any issues and are working with an integration partner, please contact your integration partner and work together to resolve them. Next, we'll cover some of the common issues you may see and how to resolve them. If you see a large number of identical identifiers are being passed for an identifier, you may have an issue where you're passing duplicate identifiers for that signal. Please check your integration and ensure that you are passing unique identifiers per conversion and are not passing any placeholder values such as null, test at test.com, or zero. 
if you see increased coverage for an identifier, this means that this identifier is missing on more than 20% of your events. If this is not expected, please check your integration setup to ensure that identifiers are being passed on each event. Otherwise, ensure that you're passing the parameter on all events. If you see reduce hash error rates for an identifier, this means that we are seeing a high level of errors due to hashing issues, such as hashing a null value. If you are using the Conversions API, we recommend you install our Business SDK and use our Test Events tool to ensure that you are hashing or passing the data correctly. Otherwise, check your Pixel or MMP setup to verify if values are being hashed correctly. If you see the identifiers sent are unable to be matched to any Snapchatter, then very few of your identifiers are actually matching. You want to confirm that the data is formatted properly. Please reference SNAP's Marketing API page for more information on how to format and normalize parameters. Additionally, check your integration to ensure that you're passing valid identifiers and not passing placeholder values such as null, test at test.com, or zero. Now, once you've implemented fixes for the identified issues, allow up to 24 hours for your EQS to update an events manager. You may also see an issue stating that a large percentage of IP addresses are obfuscated due to platform changes. This means that IP addresses are being masked due to platform changes. We suggest installing the Conversions API, if you haven't already, to assist in sending matchable IP addresses. This will ultimately enable us to match events back to more of your users, which will lead to more efficiency and campaign results. Finally, look out for alerts in Events Manager on how you can improve your Pixel setup and events. For further questions, reach out to your Account Manager, start a chat in Ads Manager, or raise a ticket in the Business Help Center.